You ready, Simon? I got this. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our inaugural episode of Running the Game. I'm your boy, Baby J, joined by my man, Vic Vinegar. How you doing there, Vicky? Hey, lady! Okay, I instantly regret that. Carbine, so, how you doing? Well, uh, Joe, I uh, I think he's got to go. He's got to go? I feel like he's got to go. Who are we going to replace him with? You know, I've got my boy Booger here. Booger? Booger. Wow! The sugary... Booger. You got any of that dope stuff right there, Booger? Unfortunately, that's what they call me, and uh, I'm here for the replacements, yeah. Okay. Well, I'm glad we're going to dig in that nose canal, and we're going to find something good. Speaking of finding something good, this is uh, okay, I'm, running I'm, the game. You, would you boys like to know what running the game is actually about, what its uh, premise is? Please, would you please tell us? Tell me. So, all of us, we're all video game ombudsmen. No, what was that word? Ombudsman. Ombudsman? Yeah. Yeah. What the hell is that? Look oh, he's a, uh, uh, Joey um, reads a lot of books. <laughs> he can, Joey can inform us. I'm yeah. very well read. It's uh, someone that's good at shit and knows a lot about it and has an opinion on it. At least one opinion, I suppose. And we got a dictionary? At least one of those things is right. Yeah, regardless. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, running the game is about, we each take a game that we are, we feel that we're particularly good at, that we have a certain gusto for. Do you have to be good at it? You know what? Just the gusto. I'm really more interested in the gusto of a, it. A passion for? Exactly. Convinced okay. that you were good at it. Well, absolutely. You're, you, you have to convince all of us that you're good at it. But here's the twist. You have to ha choose a specific challenge for you to do in a specific amount of time. And only until you finish that challenge is your trial completed. So, for this inaugural episode, I've chosen Bushido Blade 2. You must succeed. I must succeed because my challenge is I'm going to do the 100 slash mode in under 10 minutes. Now, those of you that know Bushido Blade 2 well, if you do the slash mode in under 10 minutes without dying, you will unlock both the guy with the gun and the weird kooky clown motherfucker. Now, Joe, how many times have you done this? Legitimately or just done it? What's the difference? Uh, a lot of save states on emulators. Who asked you? Never said a word. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I've done it twice on the actual PlayStation. And then I did it a bunch of other times uh, with the cheating stuff that Simon just mentioned. While cheating, uh, I no have names. a hard time doing it in under 16 minutes, so good luck to you. Thank you, you sir. You've done it before. While cheating, yes. Uh, Vic Vinegar, have you completed the uh, challenge before? Oh, absolutely not. <laughs> Never in a million years. Alright, gentlemen, wish me luck. Have you tried? Maybe. You got your no, you mana shirt on, I believe in you. You've definitely never tried it before. Alright, so... <laughs> Usually my go-to boy is Night Stalker, but uh -huh. for some reason I generally feel that I am better with Tony Umeda, which does annoy me, because what? he is uh, the not, uh, he's the Shinto clan, uh -huh. which which I am I am distinctly a Nagukagami Wait, person. Do you want to give an intro to the game? It's Bushido Blade 2. If you guys don't know what it is already... Yeah, You're not yeah. listening. You're yeah. not listening. Don't even watch. You'll, you'll pretty much get the premise as you watch me play. You will. It's, it's, a fighting, one, it's one to check out. It's a fighting game... Uh, there's no health bars, and you have samurai swords. If you land a killing blow, you're done. Yeah. And that's the life bars are sort of what you'd expect in, uh, in if someone hit you with a sword. Yeah, exactly. Sword combat. You sword lose an arm, stuff. you lose your arm. All right, so I think... Hmm. But you don't just bleed out. No. Well, I, so I guess it's not as it lasted that it's long. It's a little video gamey. I'm going to be honest. I would like to show the world my skills as Night Stalker, but genuinely, it's just one of those things where God has chosen my path. And I think it's uh, Tony Umeda. It would have been too easy. It's Night Stalker. Yeah. Too easy. So, let's go with my man Tony Umeda. Katana. Katana. Let's do it. Katana, alright. Doesn't he have a gun in his jacket? That's kind of racist. Well, I know. I, th I thought wow. that was the... I okay, that was that's, the, that's the start for the yeah, series. Right. A, a, a knife in the boot. I was <laughs> afraid that was where Joey was going to go yeah. in walk, the first five seconds. Walk away. Yeah, move, like, move, away. move away. Move away. Move away. He does roll up in a pink Cadillac, though. Does oh, he? Does he the, actually? The That's one. 19? All right. Well, that would, the, that would be the 90s, I guess. Wow. So I, as you see, uh, you mark motherfuckers are uh, pretty good. The, the first 15 kills are usually just a sprint. Wow, that's... 
That guy looks like a, a Teutonic Knight, except without armor. Clearly. Is that... that? Oh, I thought it was replays. No. no now, Joe, was... now, Joey, it's every about 10 kills you get a boss. Just yes, slightly. every 10 kills you do get a boss, and they're slightly tougher than the last boss. Yes. Oh, and, shoot. and that's the boss right there. Oh, that was pretty easy. Was that a chick? Yeah, yep. the first boss. Not Do they bad. all wear the same outfits? No, In a, uh, among sub bosses, yeah. Because I mean, the last twelve kills, except for the boss, have all had the same outfit. You know, yeah, every, between the bosses, except, except the yes. color. Which, even though I am red no. green colorblind, <laughs> I will say I noticed that the first few were red, Correct. and these ones are now green. Exactly. So every you, so the, exactly right. the format is every I don't know nine. Where I get that from, but it's uh, nine. Then. So the format is every nine people that you fight are these goobers, and then the tenth person is uh, wow. the goober that you kill anyway. Yeah, it's a geisha. It's a geisha to me. But that wasn't divisible by nine. That was that was nineteen. On oh, the twentieth, you have a twentieth kill. You're right. Yeah, and, and the tenth kill is always the uh, boss goober. Listeners, keep in mind that if Joey sustains damage no at any listening? point during these battles. He keeps that injury for the duration of the game. Right. Yeah, but if, if my arm gets jacked, two. if my arm is jacked, I can't use my arm. Right. Yes. But the only thing you lose is limbs. Like you don't. You don't slowly die like normal games. No. You catastrophically you die. You lose, lose the limbs. use of your yeah. left or right arm. Can you use your leg in this? Uh, no, Bush Bushido Blade One. Bushido Blade One is where your legs get jacked up. Yeah, Bushido Blade One, you can end up losing like both your legs and crawling along on your knees. That is delightful. You can, no, it's pretty good. You can nibble his ankles, right? You can nibble his ankles. And then, it's like a, that game. As you, you ever played that in gym class where it's the tag, but you end up being seaweed. You, you try to tag ankles? people as no, they go I, by. I, 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 no, Simon, that was just you. Yeah, really. That. <laughs> yeah, no, your gym teacher was just trying to keep you out of it. Because that was a special gym class, right? Yeah. <laughs> We weren't allowed to run because uh, our parents got upset. <laughs> that explains a lot, actually. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, with this character, when does the knife come out of the boot? He actually, uh, there's actually a special move you can do where he rolls up in a pink Cadillac. Yeah. And runs over his enemy. But he actually does? Rolls up on them like that? That's not a joke. He I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Up. Is this a joke? I can't tell. No, it's a joke. This guy looks like a Oh, thank God. Boss. Oh, it's, okay, it's the, you have the boss, the one before the decimal. Right. Yes. So it is every ten, yep. but just not really. Starts on zero. Yeah. Okay. yeah. The tenth person you fight. So the first fight. boss is the ninth, as opposed to the last boss, yeah. boss the, being the hundred The tenth when you have zero kills, that is the first person. But the bo the last, the first boss is the ninth, as opposed to the last boss being the hundred and first. You lost your otherwise, focus. Yeah, you, you get to 99 oh, kills, and then you, you, can have, you, can 10, you can have 10, 20. Yeah, you can do you that. You could, but mm. it says 99 kills, mm. and the last person is your 100th kill. Mm. No, actually, because it shows the kills before, so it is at 10s. Yeah. Because he's your 10th opponent. You're going to dull your sword. Count on your fingers. There we go. 0, 1, 2, I, uh, 3, 4, I'm 5, a professional 6, 7, I'm a professional nine, physicist. Ten. That's that's not good. Uh, I science professionally, and I yeah can do that, man. yeah you yeah you also yeah yeah you also yeah yeah. So does does Vic Vinegar, but he doesn't uh, he didn't decide to throw his uh, gauntlet in with this whole operation. I don't know what's going on here. <laughs> <laughs> he never does, folks. <laughs> oh, halfway there, home. and well ahead of schedule. Kill another gauge here. You know, it takes one slower. accident. It just takes one good hit. There I'm lies. Booger. I'm pretty sure these are all women you're slaughtering See, right now. See, you should not have taken on the nickname. I regret agreeing to Booger, but here we are. This is life now. I, I feel, am Booger. I feel like you uh, heard the fact that I was banana face and sort of embraced it. I mean, from when <laughs> you were 19, I told everyone that I knew you were banana face, and I had no idea the origination of banana face. Origin. Origination. Origin. Yeah. Come on. Come on. It's a Connecticut dialect. <laughs> It's like grinder. <laughs> so, what? A porn or uh, not a porn site? A dating site, except they call it a sandwich. Do you go on but almost for porn? porn That's what you call sandwiches. Oh, a grind? Is that a Philadelphia? Oh, thing? Hey, a grinder. No, I get it. Thing. They call uh, wedges. A grinder. grinder. I've heard that. I thought it's it was like, a Philly or Pittsburgh. It's like how you guys call package stores liquor stores. It's just wrong. It's a package store. What no, do they sell there? They Packages sell liquors. liquor. They sell liquor at the package store. No. Oh, the no. UPS is a package store. Exactly. I was FedEx. so confused for my first time at UConn. Yeah. It's like, what, so, what so do you mean? mean? What hey, do you mean? Hey, you want packy run? You want a packy run? Yeah. How, how are yeah. you? Yeah, so I thought I thought they were being racist. 
Really? Well, <laughs> we're going on a packy run? They might have been. I heard we're going on a packy run. Right. Now, growing up in New York, I figured an hour and a half away would not have vastly different vocabulary. What, what, what did you just say? What I'm sorry, sorry Joe. What did you just say? Hmm? Oh, you're the way at. Okay. We're going to the packy. What do you mean you're going to the packy? Excuse you? They're going to Pakistan. No. I, I, I was 19 years old. My ID said man. I was 26. Oh, I asked actually, you, I asked you if you want booze. You want his, a packy run? What do you say to me? His, no, you said liquor store. I you said did. Packy. No, you did. Packy run. You said like I'm pretty sure because you were on my team no. with this. Oh, you were on my team with I was this. Never on Somebody team changed teams. It sounds like I'm. Yo, Hell he's no. always flip flopped. Uh oh, he's been an ACDC sort of guy. But uh, <laughs> he, fucking, he fucking Al Gore you or what? Was Al Gore, who, who, who the been? lockbox was under the. Key. No, 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 no. Who who did uh, Bush beat in the second term? Uh, Kerry. Kerry. He yeah, carried you. Kerry, yeah. Oh wow. Ooh. Those are great checker pants though. I like this hair. That's a good death. That's a good that death. Clean death. You mercilessly slaughtering a hundred. You, you are disturbingly good at this game, aren't yeah. you? Yeah. That is run the game, uh, ladies and gentlemen, or gentlemen, I suppose. See now, everyone, uh, everyone that's uh, <clears throat> paying attention. So Joey has been very into, uh, sorry, Barry Bananas <sighs> has been very into uh, emulation in more ways than one, <laughs> <laughs> and. Uh, and apparently, you can't really save the state on this game. I'm, so, I'm sorry, I got to interrupt you there. I'm not sure what you just said, Vic Vendor, but I'm going to take that as an insult. <laughs> Go fuck yourself. <laughs> I'm going to take your big words as an insult. Yeah, I don't understand what that means, so I'm going to take that as a So, uh, Barry Bananas. Oh! oh! And with that... 86 kills! 86 kills. Oh! And with that, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to end our first episode of Running the Game. I was unsuccessful. Came pretty damn close, though. Oh! Came pretty damn close. Yeah. I had a schedule. Wait, Hopefully, I, schedule. I will succeed next time. My God. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. We'll see you next time.